guys and welcome to a Sims Free Play royalty update video. This video is going to be about the archery hobby. We have done a video on the royal lineage, I don't know how to say that, quest. I will put a link on the screen now that you can go and check that out if you want to. And we've also done a pet fairies video. Again, you can click the link and go and check that video out if you would like or they will be down in the description box if you'd like to go and see them. But once you've done the royal lineage, lineage, I'm going to stop saying that word um, because I can't say it. Yeah, once you've completed that quest, you have access to this sort of uh, royal gardens area, which is quite pretty. And this is where we do the archery hobby. So there are two um, bullseyes. Are they called bullseyes? I don't know what they're called. Two bullseyes. Where, so you can have two sims completing the archery hobby at the same time. Let's go ahead and click on this little fairy what is she saying so what's next you proved your nobility and are getting closer to the royal throne and outfits oh exciting now pass a test of skill by earning all 12 archery collectibles and then rebuild the garden statues to access the castle interior okay so let's bring over someone who can start the archery hobby so that to do archery this takes seven hours 30 minutes okay so there's only one option seven hours and 30 minutes uh they will forget everything that's fine we don't want them to dive anymore we want them to be an archer so let's take a little look is it emily i think this is emily doing the art i mean she's not so good is she really well <laughs> she's hopeless she just drops her arrow never mind so i'm gonna go ahead and try and complete the archery hobby hopefully it won't take too long but seven and a half hours i think it probably is going to so what the deal is is when you complete the first three um when you collect the first three collectibles you will unlock different statues so the first three as you can see will unlock the archer statue and the second three which i've collected unlocks the jester's statue so there's four statues around the area that we can build to make the area look all pretty. So let's go ahead and we'll build the archer statue. So this is 35,000 and it takes four hours to complete. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. It's now finished. Oh, there's a little, nice. There's a little, it's a little girl archer it looks like. Little girl archer there. It's a nice little statue. Okay, let's head on over to this one. So this is the Jester statue, and this is 50,000 to build, and it will take six hours, and it will give you a town value of a hundred, an extra 100,000 on your town value once you've built it. So here we go. We'll just use some lifestyle points to speed this up, I think, because I've got a few. Oh, look at him. I like him. He is cool. So that's the jester. I'm looking forward to the jester hobby, actually. I don't know when we'll be able to do that. So the next statue, I have got the other three things. So the next statue we can build now is the statue of the prince. So here you go. This is going to be 75,000 simoleons. It'll take eight hours to build. And it will also add a town value of a hundred thousand. So its construction is now complete, and there he is. There is the prince. Oh, he's so nice. I love these statues. They're so cute. So we've just got one more to do now. Complete the fourth line of the archery. Okay, so we need to complete the fourth line. Guys, I've finally done it. Oh my goodness. That Sherwood's finest, that last one. Oh, it just took forever. I don't like the archery hobby. I've decided. I just don't like it. It's bit, I've used quite a lot of LPs, to be honest. Um, but the Statue of the Princess is going to cost 125000 to build. And it's going to take 10 hours. And it'll also add a town value of 100000 here we go, it's now finished, and there we go, there's the princess. Oh, she's like holding out her hand to like the prince on the other side. That's cute. Let's take a little look at the like the gardens. Now all the statues have been completed. 
That's nice, I like it. So now, once you've completed the four statues, we can get into the castle. I'm so excited for this. Let's go ahead and have a little peek, sneaky peek at the building requirements for the castle. So here we go, the construction requirements for the Royal Gallery are 200,000 simoleons and 16 hours to build. Oh, we can do the jester hobby once we get inside. Awesome. Oh, we can listen to a soothing harp. Enjoy a feast. Oh my goodness, right. We are not going to enter now. I am going to make another video and I will leave a link on the screen now that you can go ahead and click on if you'd like to see inside the Royal Gallery or there will be links down in the description if you want to go ahead and check that out and why on earth wouldn't you not want to see inside the Royal Gallery. But thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys very soon in the next one. Bye!